uh, Panda series. But then uh, before we get started, if it's your first time to get into this channel, please consider subscribing, like and share this video to your friends and uh, to the returning subscribers. You can as well like uh, the video, but I really appreciate you very much for your continuous support. Now, first of all, what is a series? So guys, uh, basically a Panda series is like a column in a table. It is a one-dimensional array holding data of any type. Now, guys, uh, let me show you guys an example how to create a simple Panda series from a list. So, um, remember before anything, you must import the module. We are discussing a Panda, so we are going to import. Uh, we are going to import a Pandas. Uh, pandas, uh, Pandas. But uh, as an alias PD is. PD alias. Remember, we discussed alias in the previous uh, lecture. Now, here I'm gonna create a list. Perhaps let me call it A. Uh, this is just a normal Python uh, list. Then uh, here, remember, list is defined using these, uh, you know, uh, square brackets. Then uh, perhaps I can give it these values. Like, uh, let me say one, uh, four, uh, three, two, uh, basically four or uh, five again and so forth sorry uh, five and so forth and then I uh, here I'm gonna create now uh, the you know uh, the panda series <coughs> I'm gonna use another variable like uh, let me just say X then uh, let me assign it to PD the alias for pandas and then uh, let me say series uh, series is this the spelling for series <coughs> And then I'm gonna pass a. I'm gonna pass a. Then uh, to the print function, we're going to print. Uh, print. Uh, we're going to print x now. Then uh, let me run the codes. Uh, in so guys, uh, basically this is how we can create a symbol uh, panda series from a list. And um, remember, I told you that uh, a panda series is like a column in a table. Now, guys, uh, let's now talk about uh, the labels. So guys, uh, if uh, nothing else is specified, the values are labeled with their index number. <coughs> now the first value has an index of zero, like you can see here. And then uh, the second value has an index of one. So zero is like one, one is like two. So zero is the first index, then uh, one is the second uh, index. Like uh, guys, uh, let me show you guys that example. Um, to find, for example, the index of zero, let me use, um, let me say uh what let me just say x let me say x then now uh, um uh, let's define its index number and then i uh, do it let me uh, run the codes let me run the codes and then i uh, guess i basically can see that uh, the index of zero is one uh, and so guys uh, let's try also with the index of one you'll see it, it will give us four let me say a uh, one then uh, let me run the codes and then I guess you can see that uh, the index one is uh, is four. So indexing begin from zero. Then a uh, one is like index index two. Zero is like index one. One is like index two, and so forth. Uh, and so guys, uh, let's now discuss um, how to create the labels. So guys, uh, with the index argument, you can name your own label. Like um, guys, uh, let me use another example here. First of all, you must import what uh the pandas in the new cell you must import the module with the import keyword pandas you can use pandas or uh, you can as well use pandas is an alias pd and then uh, here uh, let me create a list again and uh, let me use a variable a then uh, let me assign it to this uh, list then uh, perhaps let me give it um two six nine uh uh three and so forth and then i uh, here um let me create my variable or uh, let me just say uh, let me use the x again you can give it any variable name or uh, any variable later and then i uh, let me say pd <coughs> pd and then a series remember guys that uh, this series begin with a capital letter this series here begins with a capital letter otherwise you'll have an error at the terminal when you run it <coughs> and then i uh, here let me say a let me say a then i uh, here let me say um index 
uh, index argument here then we are going to assign it to for example um uh, uh for example these are two i'm gonna give it um uh w let me give it a w remember it's a string so let me just say for example um or let me use a the simple ones let me just use uh, a and then uh the second one let me use a b then at uh, the third one let me use um c then at uh, the fourth one let me use um d let me use d then uh, to the print function let me say uh, print uh, print uh, print uh, you know uh, print uh, x now print the x then uh, let me run the codes and then I guess uh, basically you can see that uh, this is how you can create your your own uh, labels but then I uh, remember guys that uh, this series here must begin with a capital letter remember Python is case sensitive for example let me try to change to a small letter and then I uh, guess you can see that it has you know the error here so s must always begin with a capital letter in this uh, series uh, for read to be perfect and so guys uh, when you have created label like this you can access uh, an uh, item by referring to the label like uh, for example if you want to find uh, the label d actually the value of the label d we can just say here uh, basically we are going to uh, define the variable here then now uh, we are going to uh, now specify the the label like uh, for example if you want to find c or d let me try with the c remember the value of c is, uh, is 9 so what i'm gonna do let me just say uh let me just say c then uh, let me run the codes and then i guess uh, basically you can see it is nine uh, for example for this three so when you just say d uh you can do it you can just find the value of the label d so i guess uh, basically this is how you can access an item by referring to uh, the label uh, and so guys uh, let's now discuss key uh, value object is series so guys uh, basically you can use the key value object just like uh, a dictionary when creating a series like uh, let me show you guys an example how to create a symbol panda uh, series from a dictionary so what you do first of all you must import the code library that is pandas uh, pandas as a pd alias and then uh, here um let me use um let me use which example like um let me use some something like uh, age or uh, let me just say let me just say age um let me just just say age or um or, uh, let me just uh, let me just use an example of age then i uh, here uh let me say for example um basically is a dictionary remember dictionary is defined using these curly braces then i uh, here for example let me say uh, the first one let me say John 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 that's the key then at uh, the value let me give it uh, for example he is uh, 23 years of age and then a uh, comma and the second guy is um, let me say Marcy Marcy then uh, the age let me say 30 and then a uh, comma and then uh, the other guy let me say for example um let me say nehemiah his age is uh, i can give it even let me say uh, let me say something like uh, even uh, 15 uh, 15 and then uh, what i do um let me now create a new variable to create that uh, series so let me just use a variable x a very simple one and then uh, let me assign it to pd dot remember this series must always begin with a capital letter otherwise you'll have an error remember i told you that uh, python is case sensitive now here let me pass age let me pass age and then now uh, what i do uh, to the print function let me say print let me say print and then i'm gonna pass uh this x x then uh, let me run the codes and then again uh, basically you can see that uh, the ages of these people for example john is 23 months is 30 name is uh, 15 uh, and so forth so guys uh, basically this is how you can uh, uh this is how uh, this is how you can 
uh, create a symbol pandas series from a dictionary now remember guys that the key of uh, the dictionary become the you know the labels in this case so guys are to select only some of the items in the dictionary then uh, we are going to use the index argument and that specify the items that uh, you want to include in the series so guys are uh, for example like um let me show you how to create a series using only data from uh, from uh, perhaps john from perhaps john or uh, any anybody here um for example john in the in the mercy so what i'm gonna do is uh, here um i'm gonna add here another argument uh, another argument here uh, here uh, for example i should be here i'm gonna add another argument called uh, index index and then uh, i'm gonna assign it to uh, perhaps let me say John. I remember, is a is a is a. Um, I can say, for example, let me just use uh, basically a list there here, and then uh, let me use uh, perhaps John. Uh, remember, is a is a string. So let me say John. John. And then uh, the second one. Let me say um John and what and in Nehemiah. John then and the other guy is Nehemiah. Uh, is Nehemiah. And then um let me run the codes and then I guess uh, basically this is how you can do it. This is how you can uh, just do it. This is how you can create using only data from uh, Nehemiah render and uh, John. So guys uh, let's now discuss data frames. So guys, uh, basically data sets in pandas are usually multi-dimensional tables called uh, data frames. So a series like a column and then a data frame is like the whole table. Um, guys, uh, let me show you guys an example how to create a data frame uh, from two uh, series. So what I do here, um, uh, what can I do here guys, uh, let me just say, um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Let me just show you guys another example here. Let me just uh, do it again. Let me say import. I uh, import, for example, pandas. This is pandas. We are discussing pandas. It's PD alias. And then uh, let me just give it something like a data. And then uh, let me say, um, <coughs> uh, let me say, let me use now a dictionary here. <coughs> Remember, it's defined using these uh, curly braces. Then at the first list, let me say uh, age, age of people. Uh, let me say age, the key. Uh, basically, let me say name. Let me say name. Name, or uh, let me just say name. Uh, names. A uh, name. And then this is the key. Then at the values, I'm going to use a list. And then at uh, the values, let me say um the first one let me just use the same the first one was uh, john mm, or uh, let me just use um let me use what let me use um let me use uh, here age let me just say age mm -hmm. age then uh, the first one was um the first guy was at uh, 23 23 comma the second one was uh, 30 the third one was um 15 and uh, now this is the first what this day the first um key value then at uh, the second one guys uh in so guys at uh, the other key let me use uh for example the height so let me use a uh, it is defined using the keys defined using these are uh, you know quotation marks then at the height let me just say height height of these people then uh, the values here again I, i'm gonna give it um a list then at uh, the first one let me say the height is uh 60 feet the first one the second one let me say um 20 feet i'm just guessing the third one let me use 
150 feet feet 150 uh, feet and then now uh, to the uh, the the new uh, series this is actually guys that uh, we are we are creating a data frame uh, from these are uh, two series like uh, just a table so here I'm gonna say for example let me give it this vari variable then uh, let me assign it to PD dot data frame not data frame then uh, do it let me pass um data sorry let me pass data should be data and then i uh, here to the print function let me say print and then uh, we are going to pass uh we're going to pass x and then uh, let me run the codes and then uh, guys, uh, basically this is how you can do it this is how you can create a data frame from two uh, series so guys i see that a uh, series is like um a column then uh, now a uh, data frame is like uh, the whole table made up of different uh, series so guys uh, basically this is how you can do it this is how you can create um uh, this is how you can create data frames so guys uh, basically this is what i wanted to show you in panda series and i think you've gained something please consider subscribing like and share this video to your friends until next time uh, this is nehemiah uh, goodbye